डिजाइन डिजिटल हाई पास फिल्टर फॉर कट ऑफ फ्रिक्वेंसी ऑफ थर्टी हर्ट्स एंड सैम्पलिंग फ्रिक्वेंसी ऑफ फोर फिफ्टी हर्ट्स यूजिंग बी एल टी दैट इज बायलिनियर ट्रांसफॉर्म फॉर दैट पार्ट ए ऑफ प्रॉब्लम इज कैलकुलेशन ऑफ स्पेसिफिकेशन ऑफ फॉर डिजिटल फिल्टर calculation of specification for digital filter so we have f h p is equal to capital f h p divided by f s now what is f h p it is equal to given cut off frequency so given cut off frequency is 30 hertz and f s is sampling frequency it is 150 hertz therefore f h p is equal to Thirty by one fifty. It is point two cycles per samples. Now, omega H P is equal to two pi F H P. That is equal to two pi into point two. So it is point four pi. Now the order of the filter is not given, so we can assume order as n is equal to one. so we write here order of filter is not given so therefore assume n is equal to 1 that is order of the filter is 1 now part b it is calculation of specification for analog filter calculation of specification for analog filter in that step 1 calculation of for bilinear transformation we have equations it is equal to 2 by ts tan of omega by 2 so 2 by ts is 1 by 150 tan of omega is we write here omega hp by 2 so it is 300 tan 0.4 pi by 2 so this value is 217.96 radian per second now we assume and we assumed n is equal to 1 that is order of the filter is 1 now the second part or second step is calculation of pole positions step 2 calculation of pole positions so for that we have equation we have pk for poles 
इट इज इक्वल टू ई रेस टू जे एन प्लस टू के प्लस वन इंटू पाय बाय टू एन वेर के इज इक्वल टू झिरो वन डॉट डॉट एन मायनस वन नाव वी हॅव टू यूज द नॉर्मलाइज लो पास फिल्टर टू डिझाईन द रिक्वायर्ड हाय पास फिल्टर सो फॉर नॉर्मलाइज लो फास्ट फिल्टर वी राईट हिअर फॉर नॉर्मलाइज लो पास फिल्टर इज इक्वल टू वन देर फोर इज इक्वल टू प्लस मायनस ई रेस टू जे वन प्लस टू के प्लस वन पाय बाय टू एन के इज इक्वल टू झिरो टू एन मायनस वन एज द रेंज ऑफ के इज झिरो टू एन मायनस वन एन इज इक्वल टू वन सो एज रेंज ऑफ के इज झिरो टू एन मायनस वन एन एन इज इक्वल टू वन देअर फॉर रेंज ऑफ के इज इक्वल टू ओनली झिरो देअर फॉर द इक्वेशन बिकम्स पी झिरो इज इक्वल टू प्लस मायनस ई रेस टू जे टू पाय बाय टू एन सो इट इज इक्वल टू प्लस मायनस ई रेस टू जे टू पाय बाय टू सो इट इज मायनस ई रेस टू जे पाय दॅट इज इक्वल टू पी झिरो इज इक्वल टू कॉस पाय कॉस पाय प्लस जे साईन पाय इट इज इक्वल टू मायनस वन सो एस वन इज इक्वल टू मायनस वन नाव पोल इज ॲट मायनस वन सो वी कॅन राईट द ट्रान्सफर फंक्शन इज एच एस इज इक्वल टू वन बाय एस मायनस एस वन दॅट इज वन बाय एस प्लस वन नो पार्ट सी यूज फ्रिक्वेन्सी ट्रान्सफॉर्मेशन यूज फ्रिक्वेन्सी ट्रान्सफॉर्मेशन नो युजिंग फ्रिक्वेन्सी ट्रान्सफॉर्मेशन टू ऑप्टेन द ट्रान्सफर फंक्शन ऑफ अॅनालॉग हायपास फिल्टर we have the equation s is to but this value is 1 therefore it goes to p by s so it is 20 now this is equation 1 put this value in equation 1 so the equation is hs is equal to 1 by 217.96 pi s plus 1 so it is s pi s plus 217.96 this is equation 2 now the part d last part of the problem is calculation of hz for digital filter calculation of h z for digital filter now using bilinear transformation h z is obtained by putting s is equal to 2 by t s z minus 1 by z plus 1 in equation 2 so equation 2 becomes h of z is equal to 2 into 150 z minus 1 by z plus 1 divided by 2 into 150 it is plus 217.96 so it is equal to 300 into 2 
plus 217.96 so hz is equal to it is equal to we simplify these equations and we get z minus 1 plus 0.73 z plus 0.73 that is equal to z minus 1 divided by 1.73 z minus 0.27 this is the equation for h of z for digital filter design second order low pass digital filter of whatever type using blt that is bilinear transformation for the specification given below first is analog transfer function h6 given second cutoff frequency is given 1 kilohertz and third one is sampling frequency 10 kilohertz is given so first we write here <coughs> what is given so given is cutoff frequency fc is equal to 1k sampling frequency fs is equal to 10 kilohertz so sampling time we can find from this frequency sampling time ts is equal to 1 by 10 k and given transfer function it is hs is equal to 1 by s square plus square root of 2s plus 1 this is equation 1 Now next step is we know that pre-wrapping frequency so we write here we know that pre-wrapping frequency pre-wrapping frequency is It is equal to 2 by Ts tan or Ts by 2. So here we will assume 2 by Ts as 1. Here we assume 2 by Ts is equal to 1 because in BLT that is in bilinear transformation in BLT. Put s is equal to 2 by ts z minus 1 by z plus 1 so in the final stage 2 by ts will cancel therefore tan of omega c by ts by 2 now substitute above values it is tan of omega c is is 2 pi into 1 into 10 raised to 3 divided by 2 into 10 into 10 raised to 3 so its value is 0 0.324 now we will use the frequency transformation we use frequency transformation so it is given by formula We simplify this equation and the final equation is 5 8 plus 0.324 square. Now using VLT we can obtain HZ. Using bilinear transformation 
we can obtain h of z so h of z is equal to s is equal to 2 by ts z minus 1 by z plus 1 but we assume 2 by ts is equal to 1 so the equation is h of z is equal to s is equal to 2 by ts is 1 we have already assumed so it is z minus 1 by z plus 1 is 3 and this equation is 4 so equation 4 becomes equation 4 becomes h of z is equal to we substitute this value in equation 4 it is square divided by z minus 1 by z plus 1 square plus 0 0.458 z plus 1 plus 0 0.324 square now we simplify this equation as it is 0 0.324 square z plus 1 square divided by z minus 1 square plus 0 0.458 z minus 1 z plus 1 plus 0 0.324 square z plus 1 square therefore it is again equal to one zero four nine z square plus 0 0.2099 z plus 1049 it is z square minus 2z plus 1 plus zero point one zero four nine z square plus It is 1.79 z plus 0 0.647 now to convert it into negative power of z we have to multiply here numerator and denominator by z raised to minus 2 to convert it into negative power of z, z multiply numerator and denominator by z raised to minus 2 so the equation final equation becomes h z is equal to 0 0.1049 plus 0 0.2099 plus 0 0.1049 divided by 0 0.647 z raised to minus 2 minus 1.79 z raised to minus 1 plus 1.563 this is the final equation design digital lupus ir filter to approximate the following transfer function hs is equal to 1 by s square plus square root of 2s plus 1 using blt method Obtain transfer function HZ of digital filter assuming 3 dB cutoff frequency of 20 Hz and sampling frequency 1.28. Now what is given? Given is cutoff frequency 
it is 150 hertz sampling frequency fs is 1.28 kilohertz so it is equal to 2 pi fp so this value is 300 pi now we will consider pre wapping effect consider pre wrapping effect so first step one in that we have equation for 2 by t is tan of yes by 2 now here T S is equal to 1 by F S. So it is 1 divided by 1.28 in as it is kilohertz, it is into 10 raised to 3. So we substitute this value in the equation 1.28 into 10 less to 3 tan of 300 pi by 2 into 10 raised to 3. So its answer is 987.5 step 2 equation of is obtained by is obtained by replacing s by equation of h of s so we replace this equation it is equal to 1 divided by plus square so we substitute this value here and the answer for this is 1 divided by 10 raised to minus 6 into 1.025 square plus 1.432 into 10 raised to minus 3 to s plus 1. Step is next is step 3. Hz is obtained. H of Z is obtained by replacing. s by 2 by t s z minus 1 by z plus 1 so the equation become h of z is equal to 1 divided by it's very long equation that is it z minus 1 by z plus 1 plus 1.432 into 10 raised to minus 3 it is 2 divided by plus 1 so we simplify this equation and we get the final equation as it is 1 divided by 6.71 plus 3.67 plus 1 this is a final equation